Must have been gruesome in that cult of his. No more gruesome than the rest of Sanctuary's underbelly. I can shut out Andariel's whispers most of the time, but not always. Better a whisper than having her walk the world again. Andariel is part of Lilith and Elias's plan. But how? What do we know so far? Lilith made a deal with Astaroth. Hmm. A demon who served her father. Interesting choice of ally. And she has a key to hell. A place where she's seen as a traitor. So why would she go? And... Is she already there? We need answers. Elias used the sightless eye to contact Lilith. Perhaps it can help us. Bring it here, would you? It's risky, but we haven't got a choice. When you're ready, picture Lilith in your mind and gaze into the eye. we're looking for her. Only a matter of time before she comes after us. Not necessarily. What do you mean? Mephisto is reforming. And Lilith aims to take his power while he is still weak. So... That's what you've been preparing for. takes Mephisto's power. She'll become like a prime evil herself. She'll be able to conquer hell and sanctuary alike. I have an idea how to stop her. But for it to work, we'll need the help of an old ally. Deliver this message to Domin. He'll have gone to Kyobushad for guidance. It would strike a blow against Hell, that much is certain. But is it really for our benefit, as she claims? All her actions are driven by hatred. That is her nature, and she can never change it. I'm saying it's impossible to know. She can peer into hearts, tell us what we want to hear. You've seen it with Don and Elias and others. To trust her would mean gambling with the fate of all humankind. Not a risk I'm willing to take. The beginnings of a plan to thwart Lilith. One thing's for sure, we need a soul stone. And that means we need Donan. He'll understand when you deliver the letter. It's a relic from when the world was young. For many years, an order of rogues called the Sisters of the Sightless Eye kept it safe. Not sure how they lost hold of it, but I've heard the Sisters are not as strong as they once were. Knowledge of their craft has spread to others, 
but most rogues you see these days are not true members of the Order. More than I care to now. Her pain is primal. Wordless. Once, she was part of something more. Ugh. She doesn't like me to think on it. Everything brushed aside. Good news for once, I hope. It's from Lorath. Oh, wonderful. Mm. Mm. Stone. What? Is he serious? What does it say? He didn't tell you? No, of course not. That would require some basic degree of consideration. It's written in our code. He sent a plan. Though calling it that is generous. He wants to imprison Lilith with my soul stone. The one that held Astaroth. Can it work? Certainly not. The stone needs to be attuned first. And he will need an expert for that. Laura thinks that expert is you. Then he is even more foolish than I thought. <sighs> Go to the Horadric Vault, will you? I'll dig up what he needs. You can deliver it. And maybe then you'll leave me alone. Hold on. Did Lorath offer you his horse for the journey? No, wait. What am I thinking? Of course not. I'm old friends with the stable master in town. Tell him I sent you, and he'll offer you a steed. For all the good it did. After Skos Glen, I hoped he could give me... I don't know, forgiveness, guidance, anything. He spoke of the prophecy, his campaign against Lilith. I offered my help, but all he said was, what use has a general for a broken soldier? It's not what was in it, but what wasn't. He didn't even have the decency to mention. Ah, it doesn't matter now. He's come down from the mountain, yes. But he's still the same man who went up. Donan. Ah. Now there's a good man. The champion of the faith. Not like that old crank you were with earlier. What was his name? Uh, Lorfam? Morath? <laughs> Doesn't matter. I know uh, Donan's been through some hard times of late, so I'm happy to help him however I can. Take one of my steeds, free of charge.
keep our stables clean, dry, and warm. Not one. It's not like that. She's but a child. You brought a child? Here? It was she who brought me, actually. <laughs> Watch where you swing that stuff. It's not a toy. Who is he? He once lived in this vault. The one you're trespassing in. Explain yourself. I'm a student, conducting research on the Haratrim. What's left of you all, anyway? A student, huh? You have a teacher? Don't tell me Lorak has taken another apprentice. <laughs> I don't need a teacher to study. Lilith! Lilith! Threatens sanctuary as we speak. I need to prepare for that. With or without help. <laughs> you? Against Lilith? Well, I came to get my things. I pray they were free from your meddling. I used to be like that girl. I had more dreams than I knew what to do with. Let me unseal this. Chakit. Chispit Hilm. The stone will need to be attuned to Lilith before Lorath marches up to her. It won't hold her well otherwise. I put together some notes on the process before I left. First things first. Lorath will need my notes. Soulstone magic is treacherous, even in the most skilled hands. Tread carefully. We summoned the spirit in here. And ran him up. Borath assured me that he banished it for good, but I've always had my doubts. I'm out of essence. Father's domain. 
hatred. That's the essence Lorath will need for the attunement. I kept a map. Somewhere. Ah, uh, here. All the places Mephisto's hatred yet lingers. There's just one last thing. <laughs> Blood. I couldn't give up my life for it. Not like him. I wanted to be a man. I left to chase family, fellowship, glory. And for what? You saw how that ended. My son. I can't do it. It wouldn't work anyway. Donan. You don't understand. The stuff soul stones are made of, they're old as the eternal conflict itself. With magic so primordial, you need faith. You need spirit. I have none. What you lack in faith, you have in allies. <sighs> Who? You? Yes. You're the only one who can help us. <laughs> Unfortunately, you may be right. I can't make any promises. Really. But I can try. For you too? I'll try. Let's hear what the old man has to say. the veil of the southern jungles you're familiar with Kalha's work she's brilliant one of my favorites mine as well have you read her treatises uh, never mind you can tell me on the road on the road I'm going to help you I know the Haradrim's ways your magic even that coded writing system you use and, and don't tell me it's too dangerous. Lilith took my mother. I'll do whatever it takes to stop her. <laughs> That's a good speech. Might even convince the man you should be telling it to. Come on. I'm headed to him. But your Horodrim, isn't this your vault? It was once. Now, I suppose time will tell. I've only scratched the surface, but that will have to be enough. Lilith won't be stopped by studying alone. I don't think I will. If we fail, what would it matter whether all these secrets stay buried? 
Us three Horadrim, Elias, Lorat, myself, and an angel, Tyrael. An angel? Like Inarius? Very different from him, fortunately. Tyrael set off before Elias did. I don't know what drew him away, but I could tell he was afraid. We fell apart after he left. It is a curse. The bane of the Haradrim, but also our greatest weapon. There's nothing like it in existence. The first Haradrim used a set of soul stones to contain Diablo, Mephisto, and Baal. But such power comes at a cost. A soul stone must always be guarded. It consumes your days, your dreams. You become a prisoner just as much as the demon contained in the stone. And despite your efforts, the evil eventually finds a way to break free. Even so, I know of no better way to contain a demon. I wish I did, though. Call upon me, you know. Soul stones are no trifle. That's the donut I remember. <sighs> I need air. I'm still muddy on the details of this plan. The bones are there. Lilith aims to take Mephisto's power for herself. Before she can reach him, we use the soul stone on her. Preparing the stone will take time we don't have. Why don't we fight her? Who among us? You. Her corrupted blood still runs in your veins. No. Fighting her kind is always a last resort. Even if you could defeat her, she'd eventually come back. But a smarter weapon, the stone, would be up to the challenge. So stones usually fail, given enough time. It might not work. You can make it work. There's no one I trust more to do it. The wind is picking up. I can't... I can't see her. Taisa! I'll find her. Fumbling in the eye, let me write to your little cat. You! If you hurt her! 
hurt her. I elevated her. The runes inked into her skin form a waypoint. She is a beacon across realms. <laughs> It matters not. Her part is done. Your part is done too. Savor your breath. One. Finish the ritual from the volcano, then. Elias. That's the man who summoned Lilith. You're saying he summoned a lesser evil, too? Keep up, girl. Is Andariel gone? Yes. And Elias? He fled. Before going to the steppes, Elias came to Hawaza. Took something that wasn't his. It's why I'm hunting him. I have a friend in Hawaza who has mastered the art of immortality. She might know his secret. Let me take you to her. I thought we were after Lilith, not Elias. Finding him may lead to her. And while we look for him, you'll have time to work on the stone. That's what you wanted, isn't it? Ah, damn it, I'll bite. On one of those rare occasions you gave me good advice. You said the answers you need are often in the place you least want to look. It was you who said that. Ah, you're right. <laughs> Let's get the horses ready. Listen, I didn't mention it earlier, but uh, you did well. You stood against Andario, a lesser evil, and lived. That's no ordinary feat. But don't let it go to your head. The arrogance and foolhardy never last long in Hawazar. I wonder what old Deckard Cain would have written in his chronicles if he had seen us. Two old friends reunited. New allies eager to learn from our vast knowledge. Bound as one against the encroaching darkness, like the Haradrim of old. <laughs> they were probably lost and bitter, just like us. But Cain had a gift for seeing the good in people. 
One thing was certain, at least. Lilith meant to devour Mephisto and claim his power as her own. Had that been her goal all along? Not sanctuary, but a bid to reign in hell. And Elias, the damned fool, was too blind to see it. Perhaps we weren't perfect, but we knew we had to make a stand. We were the world's only hope.